Hello, what about you? You're very welcome. Now, if you like any of this stuff, just hit the wee subscribe button down below. And if you don't like it, then unsubscribe. It's a free vote here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Unlike this week in the Assembly. Very interesting, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, whoever said Sinn Féin and the DUP would never agree on anything? Ah, uh, well, they're going to have to reassess after this week. Because both parties united to defeat a bill by uh, Alliance Party MLA John Blair uh, to ban hunting with dogs in Northern Ireland. Something that's banned right across the rest of these islands. Now, while all the other parties allowed their MLA as a free vote, not Sinn Féin. In good old North Korean style, Sinn Féin whipped their MLAs. Yeah. You will vote the way we say you will vote. There is no room for individuality in the party. Very good. Well done. <laughs> the vote was defeated by uh, 45 votes to 38. Now, while all Alliance, SDLP, UUP, Green Party, People Before Profit, they all voted for the ban. Uh, all uh, 25 Sinn Féin MLAs, along with 19 DUP MLAs and Jim Allister, they all combined to defeat the bill. Who knew that all it would take is a bill allowing men and horses to chase a fox for hours and then have their hounds tear it to pieces while it's still alive to bring Sinn Féin, the DUP and Jim Allister under the same tent. If only we had known. What is somewhat confusing about this is that Sinn Féin President Mary Lou MacDonald indicated she was against hunting with dogs. Indeed, it's illegal down south. So foxes here would be safer going south. <laughs> I'm not going to follow that up. Cynics are arguing the reason Sinn Féin have done this is that we're a matter of months away from elections and they rely on the rural vote. Well, if that's the case, if that's true, maybe a lot of city voters will reassess and decide they're no longer being represented by the party. Now, I've been criticised for my stance uh, with the old argument that you're a city boy. You're not a city boy. You're a city boy. You know nothing about the country. And having to, having to, to, to keep a curb on, on the vermin uh, and the predators. Now, that would be true, except it's not true. I actually lived for most of my childhood in the country. All my family are still in the country. And they're not sort of lily-livered people. They're very reasonable, rational people. And if there's a need to cull a fox, they will cull a fox. But they'll do it humanely. What they don't do is jump on a pony and chase that fox until it's exhausted and then set the dogs on it. No, no, my people don't do that because that something was imported here by the English aristocracy. We don't do that. No, no, don't get me wrong, we still love blood sports. But my people only fight things that can fight back. Do you understand? That's why sitting here tonight, I have a deficit of teeth. Uh-huh. And a surfeit of stitches. Because I like your old blood sport. But I will only hit something that can hit me back. Unlike the gimpless wimps who jump on ponies and have their dogs do the fighting for them. So, Sinn Féin, I don't understand. Maybe you can explain it to me. Explain it to me. When you... That's all, folks.